Ah, just two days away till Thanksgiving. Got to get your recipes together. And not only is it turkey time, but did you know that November is Diabetes Awareness Month? And Dr. Vidya Luri is here with the University Health Systems. And you have got some fantastic recipes. And I bet you if you put these on the table and didn't tell anybody, they would never guess. I hope so. <laughs> so, the, and, and the whole really point good. is, there's no carbohydrates in these things, right? right? Yeah, there are, all these recipes we're showing today are very low in carbohydrates, making them all diabetes friendly, but also delicious enough for anyone to enjoy. And one of the tricks that people need to really catch on to, I guess you could say, is cauliflower. Yes. And even though it's not a green vegetable, this is one of the best things, right? It is. It's very low in carbohydrates and it has a very mild taste. Mm -hmm. So you can sub it in a lot of normally high carbohydrate dishes. So today we'll be making a mashed cauliflower pumpkin, and this could take the place of your normal mashed potatoes that are normally very high in carbohydrates. So in there you're putting cauliflower, which is low right. in carbs, high in fiber. Then the pumpkin puree, which is high in vitamin A and vitamin C, which is okay. great. Plus and it adds that great orange color. And it's got some fiber to it <laughs> yes, too, right? exactly. Cream. And then we've got some heavy cream. Now, you'd think with you know eating healthy and all that stuff we've got heavy cream we've got a big old chunk of mm -hmm. butter in here but that's okay so it is okay so you know there's new studies showing and especially with diabetes it's really the carbohydrates and the sugar that lead to weight gain and insulin resistance so fat doesn't raise blood sugars it really doesn't and fat mm -hmm. also makes us full so when you're using fat, um, you can make yourself fuller. You can eat a little bit less while keeping your blood sugars at a normal Don't go level. crazy with it, but right. as Don't long as you have crazy, just a little bit. A little so, bit okay. Is okay. Let's get this mixed up here. All right. And then also another little dessert dish right there, some muffins, and those have no... They have no sugar and no flour. So these muffins are made from sweet potato puree mm -hmm. sweetened with apples just apples, and they have almond butter in them for added protein and healthy fats. And, and you said the almond butter really kind of cooks yeah, up very well, right? it bakes up really well. Like if you use almond butter in baked goods, it bakes up like a cake, like a cupcake. Okay, this is, this is fantastic. Time. Let me Thank interrupt. You. This is really, really good. So, <laughs> Thank you. Okay. And, and look at these things. They are nice and light mm -hmm. and fluffy. I mean, it and looks again, like cake. You yeah. Know? It looks fantastic. Just yeah, and like these that. are flourless, and there is no added sugar, just the natural sweetness from the apples and the sweet potato. So this would be a great dessert for somebody who has diabetes, and really anybody. And another side dish, the dressing, which there is no bread in that at There's all, right? There's no bread in this at all. So again, cauliflower to the rescue. Because it has a mild taste, you can sub it for bread. You can you can dice it really small, almost to a rice texture. Mm -hmm. And this has all the traditional flavors of stuffing. There's the celery, the mushrooms, the onions, sage, the chicken broth, and you cook it all together. When you cook it down, it really resembles stuffing. Again, without if you didn't tell anybody this, you would never guess this. By the way, very quickly, you can get this on Amazon. This cookbook that she and her son illustrated together and all of these fantastic recipes, this is, and again, just... Go to Amazon, right? Yeah, so if you can I have search a treat? for Can I Have a Treat on Amazon, this is available. Every recipe has no sugar, only sweetened with fruit. Okay. Um, and everything has illustrated step-by-step -step recipes. For more information on University Health Systems, call 210-358-4000 or go online to universityhealthsystems.com. Doctor, thank you very much.